that's the worst thing in the world to see, you know? It, it doesn't go away, it sticks with you daily. You just relive it and relive it. Ronelle Levesque was nine years old, asleep in her Malden apartment when her mother started calling her name. I could tell instantly when I went in there something was wrong. It was dark, but I could hear her like moaning. So I just walked over and I seen her laying on the ground. Sheila Levesque, a 35 year old mother of six, had been stabbed multiple times while her children slept nearby. I remember them saying that there's no way this woman's gonna make it to the hospital. There's no way. And uh, my siblings started freaking out. Ronell learned the next day that her mother died. For 29 years, this case has been unsolved. But now Ronell, who lives in Manchester, is taking up the fight to catch this killer. That took me multiple years to not think about that day. To not go back and say, what could I have done different if I would have woke up five minutes earlier? Would I have been able to save her? This past weekend, on the anniversary of the murder, the family held a vigil in the same apartment complex where it happened. Levec says the hardest part for her has been learning how to become a mom herself without her mother's guidance. She also says her sense of justice is being guided by her faith. I want to forgive them so I can have peace in my life. But how can I forgive if I don't even know who did it? I want answers. I want to know why. What'd she do that was so wrong? Rennell says if the case isn't solved in her lifetime, she hopes that her children will continue her quest. Reporting live in the newsroom, I'm Andy Hirschberger, WMUR News 9.